Hi everyone, my name is Abdullah Sawalha and I will start a series about BitLocker and MBAN. This series it will contain a short videos about BitLocker and MBAN. These short videos it will be like tips and answers about multiple questions for the BitLocker and MBAN. So it will be a short videos for the most important questions that the customers and users asked me about it for the BitLocker and also the MPAM servers. So I will start this series with a most important question. How can I pick up my BitLocker recovery keys? In fact we have three ways. The first method to back up your recovery key is manual backup and also we have Active Directory Backup and Inbound Backup. Let's get started with the manual. In the manual backup, you enable the BitLocker driver and encryption in your local machine and you can save the BitLocker recovery key. As we can see in this window, it contains multiple options like save to your Microsoft account. If you have Active Directory by the way account, you can use it. Or you can use, for example, Outlook, Live, Hotmail. Also, you can save your recovery key to the save to USB flash drive or to file or print the recovery key. Um, for, this, for these options, it's good if you are using uh, your laptop or using as a personal laptop and your uh, BitLocker drive encryption uh, for local machines. But for the enterprise, you have to find another method. The second method is to store your Active Directory, sorry, to store the BitLocker recovery key in your Active Directory. This is a good solution for the enterprise. You can use um, a script or the command lines, it's managed as PDE to get your uh, recovery key information. And then you can use the manage PDE also to Active Directory backup. Okay, this option we can use it to backup your uh, recovery key. When when I say recovery key, I mean the BitLocker recovery key to the Active Directory. After you backup uh, your um, BitLocker recovery key successfully, it's supposed to be appear in Active Directory. In the U and the computer properties, it's the same thing, uh, similar like this. And by the way, these pictures I just searched and searched about it in Google, and it's a free uh, uh, pictures you can use and Google it anytime. So you can see the date uh, you you back it, backed up uh, uh, the uh, recovery key and the recovery key that you are using in case you need to unlock your drive. The last method is MBAM and we can see MBAM it means Microsoft BitLocker Administration and Monitoring and by the way this is a good solution for the enterprise uh, because as we can see there is a lot of uh, options uh, MBAM provided for um, the customer and also for the uh, uh, IT administrators. Uh, you can find reporting services, you can find data driver, manage TPM and system over, uh, overview. Um, these options are only available in the MPAM server, it's not available in the directory services. Um, this window you can see here in the drive uh, recovery you can add your ID and the uh, drive recovery uh, it's supposed to be appear here so you can copy and provide these recovery key to the client to unlock these devices so we can see here the difference between the inbound and the active directory on the active directory there is no reporting services so you need uh, a script if you want to have a report about how many users that are complaining and if the user or sorry if the machine reported it to the uh, uh, directory services or not, but the MPAM it to provide uh, web based uh, application and you can uh, visit the site to 
get the uh, recovery and by the way there is uh, a self-service uh, uh, URL or let's say a portal you can distribute it to all the users they can use it without packing to the uh, IT administrator to getting uh, these dump uh, sorry these uh, recovery keys um, this is the first video so I tried to make it uh, very very small and short sorry and uh, please if you have any question regarding to the impam or the bitlocker it will be my pleasure to answer your questions and as I said in this series it will be just questions and I will answer the informations uh, sorry these questions and to provide information about these solutions um, if you need any help or you have any question please just send it to me or put it in the comment so I can prepare uh, a video and answer uh, these questions uh, thank you very much for watching and see you in the next video